She has reading and writing difficulties. And her number work is poor. That was last year. I asked you about her last year. Yes. And you said she was very happy. Well, she was in the infants. Now she's in the juniors. That's when these things usually come to the surface. Any problems? Yes. Laura can't read or write, can she? It's not uncommon. I'm concerned, but I don't think you should feel unduly distressed about it. There are usually two or three slow learners in every class. But why has it been ignored? It hasn't, Mrs. Wyatt, and it won't be. Now she's in the juniors, we concentrate much more on the three R's. But if she can't, can't she be put in a special class? I think we should consider that very carefully. Do you think she's disturbed about the new baby? No. Well, I'll speak to Miss Miles about her at the end of the day and see how she's been. But I think we should all get over yesterday before we decide to do anything. She's not here today. Oh? I just... We just felt it better not to. Well, I think it's important not to overreact. She mustn't feel she can get away with it. Across the road for a minute. You stay there, love. I want to come with you. Stay there. 